Hey everyone, welcome back to Fear Nerd Reviews. Today, I have another review for you guys today. Today I'm reviewing blah, blah, reviewing two oils from a company called Dragon Thistle. The scents I'll be reviewing are going to be The Sea Fairer and Amber Woodsman. And both ingredients in these bottles both have Jehovah oil, argan oil, sweet almond oil, hemp seed oil, grapeseed oil, pumpkin seed oil, vitamin E, apricot oil, avocado oil, coconut, and fra fragrance and essential oils. Sorry, I don't have my glasses on, so I'm having a little hard time reading the smaller print. Both bottles are in a white label. Sorry, it looks a little messed up. Spilled a little beard oil on it, so it kind of did this to it. Um, these, I would not say these are oil proof because it did that, but the wording and everything did not run off, so that was a very good thing. They are changing the designs on their bottles, so I haven't got one of those, but who knows, maybe they're going to be oil and water resistant. But now I'm going to get into the scents for this. This one here in my hand is the, the Seafarer, sorry, Sparer. And the um, scents in this are going to be a tobacco rum scent with notes of frankincense and lemon. And this is a very nice, pleasant scent. I, the way, the best way to describe this, I guess, is it very close to a barbershop scent. But it's a very nice, fresh, clean scent. In my opinion. The only thing I don't like about this, it comes in these little popper, th these little things, but... You're like me, you can just pop it right off like that. Just be very careful. And this is a yellow ish beard oil. I say it's more on a thicker stage. And you definitely get that nice. Um, it's got that rum tobacco scent, but that I don't get really get much of the frankincense to it, but I definitely get that nice lemon scent to it. And this is a, it's a nice, pleasant, clean scent. So if you're looking for if you're someone that likes you know an interesting tobacco scent, this one would be it. I did not have to, to reapply this beard oil out through the day. The scent lasted all day, so that was definitely a plus. Awesome, awesome scent. Okay. Next scent we're going to get into is going to be the Amber Woodsman. And Amber Woodsman is a citrusy smell well, of a, a walk in a park. Oranges, orange groove with a hint of vanilla and spice. And if I had to pick probably out of these two, which one was my favorite? I have to say this one. And I wouldn't say this was very spice like on the sense of it, it wasn't a very woodsy spice, but it definitely was a nice orange. And I get a nice vanilla tone to it. I don't really get a much of a spice scent to it. It does smell really good. Maybe if I shake it up. No, I don't, I just don't really get an, um, sp um, spice, but I definitely do get a nice vanilla orange scent to it. it smells really good, it really does. Maybe a, a, also a little slight little musk. And this one also too, I did not have to reapply this at all out through the day. So I say it's more on the medium stage of thickness. So if you're worried about having to reapply this out through the day, you won't need to. I didn't have to, but definitely great sense. Both of them lasted all day. I didn't have any irritation to the skin. Um, Definitely check this company out. I give them the 10 stars, even though the bottles are like that. But as online, I saw they are changing that. So I'm not taking any points away from that. Um, but definitely a really good company. I highly suggest you check them out. 10 stars. I will put a link down below. I hope you all enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed making it. And as always, thank you so much for being part of my channel. It really means the world to me. And all, all you new people that have just subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. I'm really glad you're here. Um, if you have any questions, don't be, af don't be afraid to leave a comment in one of the videos. Or you can always got you, all of you can message me 
at my Instagram page at Beard Nerd Reviews. As always, stay bearded, stay sharp, and don't forget to stay nerdy.